Blade Show Atlanta 2023 day two is about to begin. Lots of folks lined up outside and coming in soon. All right, guys, see if you can figure out where I am. We're in the Kaiser booth, and look who has joined us. Hi. It's Crazy K. What Hi. you got? Oh, okay, so. We're and welcome to Atlanta and America and all that good stuff. Thank you so much, Casey. <laughs> so, um, this is Crazy K from Kaiser, and now I'm introducing you guys about the prototypes. And see, first of all, we've got two business here, and this is huge, and it, it is good for the campaign outdoor, uh, outdoor kitchen. And this is called Justice. It was a folding knife. We have got the folding knife version, and now we've got the fist blade right. version. Yeah. And uh, here there are others, other new prototypes, and here is the finish. The finish with the back cover handled. See, guys, listen to the sound. It's Oof. super smooth. Yeah, very. Yes. like that blade, too. Yes. And this one, it hasn't have a name yet. And see how slim it is. Some of, these, some of our fans say that it looks like a razor. Okay, yeah, <laughs> yeah. Okay, so this one is super clean and it's good for lefty users. Nice, See? yep. Okay, and this one, this mistake, is designed by Paul Monko and also the designer of Claire Wyatt and now this is his second or third design, third design with Kaiser. And these two, these two questions, so they are from Sharif. Oh, okay. And, yeah. yeah, Sharif's awesome. Yes, and guys, you must can tell it's like Aquaman version, and also the premium version. This is the Western House Makata handle and Damascus. Oh and wow! This one okay. And this bolster and green aluminum handles. Panty wow, those seaweed. are fancy. Yeah. Fancy. Panty seaweed and the drop bear. We've got other Makata. Lots and of drop bears. Bear. Yes, and that is another one. This is. Oh, does it has a name? Yeah. Oh, Jonathan Styles. Also Jonathan Styles. Okay, yeah, I remember you talking about him. Very uh -huh. cool. Okay, so now uh, I'm introducing. Yeah, the let's show that guy for sure. Look at this. Guys, Ax this Axis is Lock Sheepdog. Regular yeah. size Sheepdog with the clutch lock. Clutch lock, yes. Yes. Purple and also the black aluminum. And they are smooth. Yes. Very nice. Oh. Very nice. <laughs> You're I've good. Manicure, so. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. Awesome. So how about we move? Yep. To that we'll place. we'll move down there. Yep. All right. We're moving. We're moving locations here to see some premium stuff. So here comes our new product called Hyper, and we've got a few more those about it. And this is titanium version. Titanium with Elmis. Interesting. Okay. Yes, and it's brush finish. Brush finish. And then we've got the rest too. Um, Okay. This oh, okay. is the classic one. So mo removable, changeable scales on the back. Okay. Yes. And this is aluminum and the S35 green steel. And there's another one, the black and red. It's out of stock. It's, it's out of so stock. Out. It's gone. It's gone, yeah. yeah. And also, For now. Al aluminum handle and S35 green steel. Okay. And you can also spread the scales like this. The green gotcha. and also the purple. Gotcha. Yeah. So now let's come with... So yep, I'll follow. I'll go right around here. We're still going, guys. There we go. Alright, guys. So this is the premium jump bear, our tenth anniversary version. And let's see. Take a closer look. First, Damascus, and second, this is the wow. Westinghouse Micara handle. Yep, yep. Yeah. Time must cast stop, and also the clip, and also the titanium hardware. Beautiful. Beautiful. Yeah. Oh yeah. Oops. Ooh. Might want to get it on camera here. There we go. Yeah, that's and very it's smooth. Only 100 limited. Oh wow, okay. It's, it's super that's nice. beautiful. So come by and check that out guys for sure. Mm -hmm. Very nice. Whoops. And this one is it's, the it's same oh it's the same, same thing. Yes. Yeah. Gotcha. Prepare free here and one was sold out yesterday. Very, very cool. So Kate, thank you. It is so good to meet you in person. This is, is very cool. So, uh, appreciate you and uh, thanks for the tour. Oh, All thank right. you. Guys, check out Kaiser Knives. Hey guys, we're at Concept and this is Jake. And Jake was showing me a couple of things here. I'm just going to do a quick breeze by and show Jake. What am I looking at right here? What are these two? This is the Main Street with that crossbar lock style knife. 
I love it. It was really rough out of the box, but after playing with it, it is so smooth. It makes me think like, you know, a lot of those different companies, even um, Tactile Turn, they have to kind of wear in and then they're just beautiful. Yep. Yep. And, the little and then he's got a little mini one here. Like, his, like his, the baby little mainstream. It's beautiful. And what's, uh, we're Lightning looking at Anno. Lightning Anno. Okay. Titanium. Yep. Beautiful knife. Beautiful, beautiful knife. And then they've got all kinds of stuff here at the show, guys. You can see. What's that one? This is, uh, I want to say Shakira, but it's... Uh, <laughs> uh, Come on, you got it's this. Shikari. 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 There we go. <laughs> this is the bun lug Shikari. So we got the larger Shikari that people love. I'm coming. It's here somewhere. It, it grew legs in the They got a few knives here, guys. So I can't find the, the big boy, but it's a, it's a large shikari. They just went and, and brought it down to a smaller form factor for the bunt lock, and it is absolutely phenomenal. And what I like about it is I can have it open. If I'm going to hand it to somebody, I can just whip it and I can hand it to somebody just yep, like that. Yep, yep, yep. It is amazingly smooth. Very, very cool. Well, guys, come by and check out Concept and check them out online. Very, very cool. Thank you for your time. Love, man. All right, guys, this is my buddy TC, Smoky Mountain Knife Works. Yes, sir. And as you can see, they have got a heck of a booth going on here at Blade Show. And you guys have a special for the show. What is this? What this we is got? our brand new Microtech, Ultratech X-Wing right here. And we've got, uh, I think we've got maybe 15 or 20 prototypes left. So the ones that we've got here at Blade Show are actually stamped prototype right there. Ah. Um, so these are going to be special. We're going to make maybe a couple of minor cosmetic changes before the production run um, here in a couple of months. Um, but that's what kind of makes these special. So um, they've got the dates still stamped on them and X-Wing stamped on them. But a couple of, and now we're also doing sign-ups so that if you want to get uh, signed up for the production run of X-Wing, um, all you got to do is tech text rebel scum rebel scum to 82643 rebel scum there's isaac and uh you can get in on the first flight there so <laughs> what we're actually going to do with that first production run is um anybody who texts that number and gets signed up they're going to get the opportunity to buy that knife right before anybody else even uh, that's sees cool it, before Very we cool. actually release it so um it gives them kind of something special and a, and a low number on the serial yeah, that's serial awesome number, so this was uh, kind of a fun little project. Like, So we went and did a tour of the Microtech facilities, and that was the day that we ended up meeting with them and, and you know, it, it, introducing this idea to them. And Tony was, like, all on board, and he was like, I think we can have some of those by Blade Show. Oh, uh, it's cool. And Wendell and Jess were over in the corner, and they were like, <laughs> we, we don't have time, Tony. We don't even have enough people to make the knives that we got to make for Blade Show. And he was like, I don't care. We'll get it done. Okay. So they, they ended up getting us uh, almost 50 of these. Good, um, good. And, uh, I mean, they turned out really Yeah, cool. they're very cool. I'm and, a big nerd anyway. And so. they're going to, TC's just going to wear this to work for the rest of time? This is, no? Okay. Absolutely not. Absolutely. I, I actually think when I get back to my hotel room there's, tonight, there's I'm going to. Greg, Greg back there, and he's telling me it's very hot. I think I'm going to set so. it on fire. That's <laughs> what I'm going to do when I, get, when I get out of it today. I think that's what I want to do, but. It's been a great Blade show, and uh, uh, we've had fun seeing everybody and awesome. seeing some new stuff. So. All right, well, good. Good to talk Absolutely. to you, my friend. Thank you so much. Thank and, you, guys, check out SMKW for sure. And don't forget, use code SMKW Knives Fast for free shipping at checkout, and it helps the channel. So yes, thanks, does. guys. Weird angle with me, of course, but look at this guy. So <laughs> this guy, Big Red EDC, of course. Look at that shirt. Look at that shirt. Uh what have you seen so far that people should know about? What, what's first of all? Are you meeting cool people? Oh, of course. Yeah. Oh, I was just, I was actually just walking around with Scab here a little bit ago. Okay. Um, yeah, I ran into him briefly. Finch, of course, their yep. first show. I've been, I've been over there a little bit. We'll yeah, just me say. too. Me we'll, too. We'll just say that. But uh, oh my goodness, there's so much. Yeah. There's so much out there that it's just. Stop by Benchmade, talk to them. I still need to make it over to QSP and chat with David yep, for a little yep. while. I want to get over there. Got some, he's got some new stuff coming out for Orion that I want to check out. So uh, Yes, he had some ones I didn't even know about. I know. And uh, very cool. I know, secrets. He showed me secrets. when we were loading in on Thursday, yeah. Um, and, of course, I kind of want to go over and check out Todd Bag and stuff. So 
Very, very cool. I'd yeah. like to go check that out I as mean, well. I want to check out everybody. There's just not enough time. Because I'm not going to be here tomorrow. Right, right. It hurts a little bit. Under, but understood. That's the way it is. So, yeah, very cool. And uh, thank you so much. Guys, check out Big Red EDC, of course. And uh, don't forget SKL every Saturday night. Some ungodly hour when I'm usually asleep. <laughs> It'll be uh, earlier tonight. Yeah, it'll be it earlier not. tonight, but very cool. And uh, did you buy anything? I got so far. I've got oh, look this at nice that. Sage grouse leather. Yeah, spread. that was a, those were over at. Uh, and of course, I had to go get the Lusa hat to Jack. Ah. Uh, nice dragon scale on it. That's pretty. Yeah. Very nice. That's pretty. So there you that's go. That's it so far. That's it. So, those slips are awesome. They are. They're beautiful. Sage grouse does an awesome. River's beautiful. a cool dude. Yep. All right. Well, thank you. Thank you. And have a good rest of the show. You too. Bye. All right, guys. We'll do more. I don't know. Hopefully, if I can get away from the table. <laughs> All right, guys. This is Michael Martin from American Blade Works. And Michael, uh, you know, I just had the Model 2 in, and looks like you've got a bunch of Model 1s. And then uh, some of the Model 2s. Tell, kind of tell me about this. When you said this was a design that happened a long time ago, but yes, just I, coming out. I originally made 12 of these about four years ago. And so we've been uh, a long time wait to bring it back out again. <laughs> uh, the original version was a frame lock. But we, uh, we gotcha. did a line and lock on this. That way uh, customers can change their scales if they like Gotcha, and I love the blade finish. That's one of the things between the milling and the blade finish. Those are the two things that really catch my eye on this one, and then it feels excellent in the hand. So really, really nice. And then we have a fixed blade here, and you—he was also telling me that there's uh, lots of code that went into making this thing. So, yep, that was but just like uh, everyday carry pocket, um, yep. I mean, uh, fixed blade. Wow. Yeah, we made those just for the knife too to see what people thought about it. Very cool. I, I like how that one feels as well. Uh, it feels like it would be a good one for EDC or or like bushcraft or that kind of thing. Very much so. Very cool. Well, guys, uh, definitely check out American Blade Works. Made in North Carolina, yeah, right? North Carolina. And uh, a lot of you guys tell me all the time, you want more American made knives? Well, support this guy. And you'll get more American-made knives. So there you go. Very, very cool. Thank you very much. Thank you. All right, guys. Looks like you can figure out where we are and who we might see here. What is up, guys? Yes, we sir. Over here. Oh, no. I love it. So you want to hear about the new stuff? Yes, I do. Let's see what we got. Okay. We got the new Lander 2. It's a little bit bigger. I love it. Look, guys. Look at that. Look at that. Quarter inch clutch Very locks nice. on it. So ambidextrous. All the lefties, the southpaws, like, they they don't love my liner locks. So this is your original lander. This is your lander two. You can see the size, but the lefties came after me because the lander one, right. the original, is a liner lock. They wanted a lefty liner yep. lock. I said, no, you get a clutch lock instead. <laughs> Take that. No, but I'm excited about it. Um, the OEM on this one, the, the folks making this Kaiser knives. Okay, so when excited. you said clutch lock, that's what I thought. Yeah, so, so I mean, it's a, it's a crossbar lock, but it does have the adjustable spring right, on okay. the inside, which I'm super excited about. And Kaiser was like, yeah, go for it. Um, so I'm, I'm stoked about that, and uh, just a solid little knife. And same deal with the scales, swappable, yep. the, the files will be out there. And, open source, yep, open all source. that good stuff. Yep, so, so you can you can download the CAD, you can make your own, sell your own, whatever you very want. Very cool. Do. And guys, the action is as you would expect from a Kaiser clutch lock. That's very nice. Very, very nice. Hollow grind looks like. Uh, flat, actually. Flat actually, yeah. okay. Yeah, yeah, sorry, looking through camera, you can't tell. So this one's flat. So are are the is the original lander, I can't remember, is it flat? Flat grind is yeah, well. Yeah, so the I think the one from Urban EDC is is awesome. hollow. It's also flat. It's all a flat grind. Are you sure? I'm an apple cutter. I got small children. Okay, all right. I don't like. I, s I swear, I thought grind. that one was hollow, but I guess I'm crazy. No, you're I not. am crazy. No, you're not. But no, I am. <laughs> but I mean, I love that size. I love the fact that scales, guys. You can still, as you can see over here, lots of options on scales, and uh, 
What else you got coming out? Anything? Ooh. Anything worth talking about? We no, gotta, we, only no. what you can tell. We got a couple things that are fun, dumb little things, right? So we made titanium rulers yep, for yep. years. We're just coming out with an aluminum one that should hit in the next couple of weeks. And yep. it sounds dumb. Angle but finder like, on them and having a, an aluminum angle finder ruler. I use the ruler all the time. So that's coming out. I'm trying to think what else. We're working on a loaded Aluminum's burrito good. for everybody. So that should be fun. Very too. cool. And I love your vibe. That's, Thank you. To me, that's that's the deal. I mean, here I am with my, you know, tornado, my hurricane or whatever. Yes. But I like I like the, the cat, the fun stuff. Yes. The kids love it. It's good. <laughs> You're a good marketing guy. Oh, I mean, I you get it. That. I don't know about I that. I mean, come on. But, no, it's good to finally meet Appreciate you in person. You, Appreciate you very much. Thanks. And, guys, check Thanks, out guys. NAFS. Uh, all the website, all the social media, everything else. So thank you very much. So guys, I'm at Todd Bag Knives here, and you're not going to believe this, but they're coming out with slip joints, and these are fantastic. They're going to be 14C and sub $60 for these big ones and sub $50 for these small ones. Uh, look at the options. You have liners. Uh, I mean, I just absolutely beautiful knives no, coming in mid-September, yeah. they, they and do that. absolutely yeah. gorgeous. So you're you're into the burst, though. You're into the micro burst. Very cool. Okay, guys, it's been a phenomenal show. Thank you so much, uh, all those who came by the booth, and thanks for all the support, guys. Hope you enjoyed this video. Uh, if you did, definitely like, comment, subscribe, and all that good stuff. Stick around for more content, and thanks for watching my Blade Show coverage, even though it was a little less this year because I have my own booth. Uh, I hope you enjoyed it very, very much.